we can win the league, but I buy the players. That's the message from Hearts major shareholder Vladimir Romanov. The Lithuanian was speaking before he climbed aboard a supporters bus and watched his side win yet again. Hearts maintain their 100% record in the league. Chris McLaughlin spent the day with the man in charge and his fans. <laughs> All aboard for the Romanov revolution. And the man who's taken them there was on hand to show he's as pleased as they are. I'm convinced that we can win the league. I'd like to reiterate what I've said before about the fans. The fans here are exceptional. Um, and perhaps it's easier for me to see that coming from the outside. In the pub, one lucky fan even got the chance to speak to his new hero on the phone. What your name? What's your name? <laughs> even if his name was lost in translation. But are there similar problems between the Lithuanian and his manager? It's a perfectly natural thing that between the, the, the boss and an employee, there should, be, uh, there should be problems or frictions. If the boss is asleep, then there are no problems. Gifts from the fans, but the Lithuanian made it clear earlier that when it comes to players, he'll do the buying. So does George Burnley have any say on who comes in? Thank you. He has that possibility. He's um, made, made many suggestions as to players that we should buy. All I'm saying is that the final word lies with me. At the start of it, he was a wee bit uh, only sure what he was going to be like. But now he's put his money where his mouth is. He's coming along. He's uh, mingling with the supporters. And I think he's doing a great job. You know, he's standing up and being counted. I can't believe it. Um, it's an absolute privilege and an honour. And any heart supporter will tell you, this is a man that saved our club. <laughs> Few of his fellow fans would disagree.